Have you hung your stockings by the chimney with care? If you're still holding out on the hopes that St. Nicholas will soon be there, you may want to prepare. We're just under 20 days away from Christmas Eve. Ah! If you're now scrambling to figure out how to hang the stockings, put the duct tape down and drop the ideas of putting a hole in your mantle. We're showing you how you can create your own DIY stocking holder that adds another level of festivities to the already glamorous oh, season. Oh yes, glamorous. Okay, yes. so you're a crafter? I'm a crafter, I'm, I, I, yeah. So this is the moment our audience has been waiting for. Maybe I can get fact checked because I'm usually like, you know, blah 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 blah, and nobody knows. <laughs> oh for sure. no! So these are really easy, and the two things I brought you today: one's a stocking holder, one's sort of more of a mantle decor. But both of them are what I want to say, kind of dupes to some higher end modern stores sure. that I won't name. But there are things you might buy for a lot more. You'd probably have to order them online. They're not locally mm -hmm. made. Mm -hmm. But these are going to be... Well, we all get those catalogs, and we, we all drool yes. over them. And this first one I'm showing you, I, they stole it from me. I made it up first. Oh. Then I turned the catalog over the other day, and I was like, what? what? Okay, so this is a stocking holder. Kay. This is going to be pretty much our end product, product here. Um, I need to maybe do a little more spray oh, paint sure. on it. Oh, sure. Yeah. But it's just a nice, modern, mm -hmm. nutcracker mm -hmm. stocking holder. I love it. What do you think this would run you at a, a store, a nice store? Oh, gosh. I, I don't know. I'm thirty-two dollars and fifty seven cents. We were playing the prices right, you would have just won because it's thirty-four dollars available what? on this at this particular oh store my right gosh. now. Okay. okay. You, you didn't even go over. Uh -huh. So here's what we're gonna use. <laughs> I got these at Hobby Lobby, they're kind of cheap plastic ornaments. Sure. I think they were original they're three ninety nine but always fifty percent off. Oh always. So we're gonna start with two dollars. Sure. These come in two packs at Target for ten dollars. All right. So this is gonna be a Five, six, seven dollar. Oh, you're doing a lot of math over there. Okay. Uh -huh, uh -huh. So here are the steps. First of all, okay. you don't want. I didn't. I should have. We could use a knife. Oh, yeah. Well, you don't, don't try this at home. Here. All right. This. We is, don't need the. We don't need the thing anymore. All right. Here's the knife. And then it still. This is kind of you know detail, but it still has the ornament hanger. Oh, sure. Take so that just, off. It just comes out. Like yeah. it actually just slides right out. You pull it. As if it was. Wanting it to, wants be to be something, something different, else. And yeah. Always have a what is this needle nose pliers? Yeah, something. I don't know. I, whatever I grab out of the sure. my husband's box of tools. Okay. I'm, typically, I'm not using for the correct. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I know. I'm sure. There this you go. Is. Okay. All right. So the next step is to glue it down to the actual base. All okay? right. So do you use Gorilla Glue? Oh, big one? fan. Okay. Big fan. Do you follow the directions and get one of the surfaces wet? No. So the glue is activated by, yeah, here, I'll just show you, Emily, right here it says. Water? Gorilla glue is cured with, yeah, so oh my you just goodness. want to get one part of the surface wet, and I get the bigger surface wet because the glue goes on the other surface. Oh, my gosh. Right? You learn something here today. Oh, wow. So then I just take the bottom of my um, ornament. Okay. Yep, this and is going to be. And I put the glue around Kay. like that. Not using hot glue. Nope, Gorilla glue. Gorilla glue. This is going to be stronger. Okay. And then I just. Center it and stick it down on. Okay. Right there. Yep. And then, well, it has to dry before it works, so just there you go. Yeah. Okay. Um, Gorilla glue, glue works better if you clamp it down, but I didn't think it mattered for this because it's not like the stuff, the, the nutcracker isn't holding anything up. Okay. Right? The, the Gorilla glue is not working for me at the moment, it's okay. but it it's will hard. in real life. Okay? Yeah. All and right. so then here's what happens when okay. you Gorilla glue something. It turns, the Gorilla Glue is not clear, it turns like all white and gross. Ooh. Like that. But it's really strong. Yes. And since we're going to spray paint it anyway. Okay, here's the knife. Yeah. The children do not try this, this at home. This is the part you don't this have. Is, then you just, I just scrape away. Okay. Oh, it comes and it, right it's off. it's just kind of like a, it's kind of yeah. like that foam. It's like a little foamy sort yeah. of foam. It's really easy to do. Um, I would maybe be more careful with my glue if I wasn't going to end up painting this. Sure. But. Spray paint covers all, mm -hmm. all right? mistakes. So then, okay. you just take your handy little spray paint box, yep. set it in there. You could use whatever color you want. I think sure. black is super modern right now. Absolutely. I thought about like a navy teal. Or what about a rose gold? Rose gold. What? See, here's the thing. You can have whatever you want, right? And you could change it year to year. And then make sure you spray it kind of light and, at and first. And wear masks while you're doing this. And then right? you're going to want to do several light yep. coats. This one. Do this in your garage and. And then voila. Oh my goodness. You've got a little. Look at that. Know, tilting and funny. There we go. 
So this one still needs a coat or two. You can see the white still sure. under him, but yep. totally ready to be like amazing stocking. Oh, holders. and should we try it out? Yeah. Look at yeah. this cute. That's stocking my stocking. That Ashley made. You'll notice he my reindeer drinks wine. And always with the accessories. Always right with there. the accessories. Uh -huh. Yep. Uh -huh. Okay, so that's one option. All right. Now Love for it. kind of a mantle decor. Okay. This is another tree. That's kind of fancy. It's also at one of those stores. You probably buy it for like $40. Yep, we get the catalogs. Or this is from Target, yep. Wonder Shop, and it's like $9 I maybe? think so. Yep. $10. $10. Okay. Then all you're going to do, and this is super easy, you're going to love this. I'm taking beads to make ornaments. I think it's best to do like a multi, like different sizes and colors okay. are better, I think. All right. And then you just put them on, but you want to see what, what, what the part that's going to blow your mind. What? These, since they're beads. Yes. You just, like, literally don't even have to use glue because it oh. sticks right on there. What? <laughs> this is so cute. <laughs> right? I'm going to Target after this and getting this. So you just stick the beads right now, on. Now, these are not fancy beads. These are cheap beads. Yeah, these are they, like, are like, they were like $3 at Hobby Lobby, sure. probably. Yeah, these are not the expensive ones. Probably. No, they're not. And, they're just, and because they're beads and they have the hole in them and these are oh. wire trees, they just go right on. This is sort of therapeutic. Now, on my tree... I went around and I tried to get varying sizes and colors on the edges. Yeah. And then for fun, I did take a hot glue gun what? and put just sure a did. couple, just a few on some of the inner branches yes. just to make it a little bit more. Okay. What do you think? I well, look at me. I'm having fun. I'm obsessed. You're almost this done is too. Darling, I so love this. A nice festive tree. You could do this and these tinsel trees come in so many different colors and varieties. I mean, you could get you could do a really like a regular evergreen one. Oh, sure. With yeah. traditional colors. Like cranberry mm -hmm. kind of looking. Well, my kids don't know this, but or I'm making one for each one of them tonight. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Isn't that fun? Oh, it's, it's just right. adorable. So we've got so it all. Fun. We've got our, our stockings are going to be yep. hung by the chimney with care. Yep, and all we right. got some, a little bit of bedazzled. For Niklaus. Niklaus. Tog. Saint Niklaus. Okay. Yes.